Well, you can see it behind me. It's unmistakable as you make your way to downtown Greenville. There's the mural. And as you mentioned, that final face, it was a mystery until today. But we finally got to not only see who's on the mural, but I also got to speak with her. This is her message on education and community. We talk children from every race, every creed, every color. Retired Greenville County school teacher Pearly Harris, her legacy immortalized in Greenville's newest mural. I was a part of that integration. So I went into the schools before we integrated. And then when we integrated, I was that teacher. Eight story tall piece shows her surrounded by students of all backgrounds. The Australian artist spent weeks speaking with community leaders before he decided who he would paint. So I've just I've just put, you know, maybe a visual representation of of, of something that yeah, people can interpret and work towards growth in, in their own way. And while the artist didn't decide on Harris or the theme of education right away, the goal of the Charleston based development group that commissioned the work was to have it be a showcase of voices. Guido had a year waiting list. So uh, for it to all happen and then and then here we are in the times we are today with with uh, you know unusual events. It's kind of timely. It's been described as a display of racial diversity and inclusion. What does Harris hope the children in the mural, real kids at A.J. Wittenberg School, what does she hope they see when they look up? I would hope that those children and their parents would see dedication, love, understanding, communication, and commitment. Those are the things that I thought about when I was a teacher. How committed are you to the things that you're doing? Now, if the name Pearly Harris sounds familiar, you might know her from the Bon Secours St. Francis Center for Breast Health. It's named for her, and she says she still volunteers there when she has the time. Live in Greenville, Renee Wonderlich, WYFF News 4.